getting started with video, video creation, video marketing, all of that is extremely important. You hear about us talk about it all the time. So I got the godfather of video creation in the insurance industry with me right now. The recently 30 old, old man, Cody Aska, to talk about video, video creation. Bro, you have innovated on the video production space. You've invested heavily into what we're sitting in right now. Yeah. Why is it that you doubled down and went so big into video you know, uh, creation and also what are some tips for people to get started? Yeah. I, well, number one, I never thought I would be sitting here doing this or have invested in this much money into it or even did it this much or this often anyway, you know, or had like video teams and everything else. Uh, but when, when you do it and you see it work like anything in life, you know, it works, you're not going to stop, you know? So, so we, we did it. I did it on my phone, you know, like this, you know, hey, I made eight grand this week and you can too if you just follow these seven easy steps, you know, stuff like that. And, but not that eloquently four and a half years ago. Yeah. It would have been like, no doubt. I would have been wet in my pants and, oh, this is Cody. Thanks for watching. You know, and it would have sucked. Um, <laughs> but I saw it work and six months, 12 months, 18 months into it, I'm like, people are watching. They're commenting. They don't hate me. Uh, they're making fun of me. Cool. Uh, and, I just like, man, this is working. So I really just got serious about it, doubled down, and here we are. Well, so, you know, what are we, what this video is for is to really help that person sort of get over the hump of, I want to. Yes. I just am not. Yes. So, if what's your recommendations for that person, first off, briefly? Yeah. I mean, they, they, they don't, they don't have to have a studio. They don't have to have a microphone. They don't have to have a video guy. Okay. They don't have to have a, $3,000 camera or a $20,000 camera or whatever. They don't have to have lights. They don't have to have TVs, you know. Uh, they do have a nice shirt, though. You know, that helps. Uh, so, I mean, if you take all that away, you can still do video and be good at it. Yeah. Y you know what you need? This and some courage to put it out there. I agree. That's it, you know. And and you can, like, research what video, video titles you should be doing, you know. Uh, if you want to do videos for people that are on Medicare so you can get more leads that way for like SEO related, then go find some Medicare videos that are doing good and talk about the same thing. You know, I agree. Uh, you need this. You, you really need an idea of what you want to do videos on. You need this. And then you need some attractive titles and you just need to outline it and then talk about it. So I'll put you on the spot. Okay. What are the first four videos that a new agent should create? Mm. Um. So g give me an example of what type of videos they would do. Let's just say and I'll Medicare. give you some ideas. Let's, okay, say, so let's just say Medicare. Okay, so uh, I would say if I did research, the probably the first video, um, I mean, you could do like a trailer, like a channel trailer video, you know, I'm this, I do this, here's why you should work with us, here's the top mistakes people make, and we're going to solve those for you, you know, stuff like that. Um, or you could do something along the line. I mean, you, you could actually go research um, and if you type in like Medicare, I bet something about like Medicare supplement plan F versus plan G is going to pop up. I bet like, hey, should I choose Medicare supplement or Medicare Advantage is probably going to pop up. Um, what should I do when I turn 65? You know, who should I work with? Um, those type of simple questions. I mean, the main thing to do is what are the most common questions that you get from your Medicare clients and then address those via video? Let me answer that a different way. What I would yeah. do is I would go to my website pages that are the yeah. most common website pages and I would create a video for that website page. Perfect. Put them on YouTube, embed it through YouTube on your site. Yeah. That's how I'd get your first list. I love it. So whenever I talk to people and they're like, but I just, there's just so much to talk about. What do I even do? And I'm like, bro, just go to your website, go to all your tabs and there's your first 10 videos, dude, right yes. there. And then by the time yes. you get done with those 10, you'll get your juices flowing and there's all other stats, you know, strategy you can do that way. That's right. So, um, we're seeing a lot of people get started with video in our, in our, in our industry that are having some courage to just do it. YouTube or, or Vimeo? Well, <laughs> uh, we use Vimeo to like store some stuff that nobody finds, but we use YouTube to get found. And because Google owns YouTube, if you search second biggest search engine in the world, if you want to get found, if it's purposes, organic leads, purposes, SEO, purposes to pop up on Google or YouTube, et cetera, then it, or, you know, definitely YouTube. We don't uh, 
upload our videos on Vimeo unless we're doing some sort of like landing page embedding because Vimeo has some, most 99% of the time we're doing YouTube. That's correct. But I still get that question, you know? Yeah. And I'm like, I'm like, really, why would you even ask at this point? Like YouTube sure. pretty much has the market. It is the number one most searched video platform on planet Earth. Yes. It's the, the statistics are staggering. I know, I know Medicare guys that are stumbling into crappy thumbnails and crappy titles, but just have done videos and have 1,200 yeah. videos that now get 70, 80 policies a month off of them. Oh, so there's a lot of people like you that maybe don't watch like TV shows or movies that watch podcasts or YouTube videos and, you know, in their spare time. That's, that's all, pretty freaking common. That's all I do anymore is watch YouTube stuff. And then also once you get your, your budget moving, YouTube has some really awesome tools to market specific yep. to paid YouTube platform. And if you have videos, it's much easier um, as well. Um, Cause you can do like you hired a, a YouTube coach yeah. and he like kind of blew a lot of our minds about yeah, some of the yeah. things he was doing. He said he'll even put like five second or 15 or 30 second promos of his products on his own YouTube videos instead of promoting his own stuff every single time. Didn't he tell you that or, yes. am I, or if I misquoted? Yes, he'll put some ad buffers on his own videos yeah. instead of making the video salesy. Yeah, which yeah. I think is freaking brilliant. I didn't even yeah, thought about it. Totally. totally. And th those first five seconds of the ad that you can skip now are free anyways. So that's an impression. Yeah, so that's if you're ever doing an ad like that in the first five seconds, you really want to call them out. You know, like, hey, if you have money... And you want to get better at selling over the phone, you know, yeah. et cetera, yeah. whatever. Because if they don't, then they're going to like skip it. You know? So let me ask you a question that I don't know the, what you're going to say to this. Should every insurance agent have a YouTube channel? That's a really good question uh, that I've never been asked. And if you're wanting to locally sell, I think, I think it would still help with that too, though. So I was going to say no, but I think it, it can't hurt. You know? I mean, early on, didn't you do a bunch of videos with you in your car? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Driving to appointments. That's hey, it. guys, you know what? I'm on my way to Brawla. That's right. I was thinking about my book of business the other day, and I just I came up with this little, you know, blah, 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 and then all of a sudden you're a video in. Yes. And you really didn't have to, like, do, do all that much work. No, no. And I, we weren't editing it or adding all these yeah. annotations and end screens, all this other stuff. Like, we were just, or, you know, whatever. We were just uploading. I was just uploading it and giving it a title and saying, oh, see ya. You know? Cool. And But what's cool about YouTube, and if, once you get started with videos... It will become it's it's a snowball effect that that doesn't slow down and doesn't get smaller. And it's really small when you first start. You're like, is that really a snowball? I don't know. And then later <laughs> you're like, holy crap, I'm gonna get ran over by that thing, you know? And so now we get about twelve hundred subscribers. Last time I looked was like twelve eighteen, I think, last month. Which is incredible, dude. And that's new subscribers of the channel that and are like, hey, Sam I wanna either. learn. There's another three hundred or two hundred that are coming from Sam. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Which is which is amazing. Well, I mean, at this point in the, this day and age, I believe that every insurance agent should have a YouTube channel, even if it's for nothing more than to have a video on your website being yeah. embedded by YouTube. Yeah. Well, this will prove your theory. I did a post recently of me um, with my face all jacked up, and it was really an allergic reaction a couple weeks ago that I just had. But I put it on Facebook and said, like, hey, I, I. Uh, uh, had a first boxing lesson. I challenged a number one boxer in Springfield. Uh, I lost and I lost my Jaguar because I challenged it for pink slips. Yeah. You know? And people believed it, you know, and, and then I did another video stand, you know, another, uh, uh, picture standing in my Jaguar with boxing gloves on like, Oh, I want it back. You know, people are like, congratulations. I did it for attention and engagement. But the reason I bring that story up is there was a guy that was, that's interviewing right now to be on the sales team. And he called me, he's like, Dude, I got to ask, is that really true? Because my <laughs> wife's never going to let me work for you if you freaking, you know, negotiate, if you gambled a car on a boxing match. I'm like, no, it wasn't real. And then he said, dude, the reason I'm bringing it up, multiple people in Springfield, and we don't even really have like that much of a local audience, multiple people in Springfield sent me that post and said, this dude is insane. <laughs> and I'm like, so there's one point. Even if you don't even know what you're doing, you at least stay top of mind. Dude, that was, we were sitting at lunch together and we were doing that. You yes. actually were like, we were talking at Hanode while you were making that post. And you're like, should I post it? And I'm like, bro, yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, and my wife hated it, but it got engagement, attention. People talked about it. Well, I've dude, gotten so many calls, texts, and emails. We had a client come in town and he's like, did Cody really lose his jack? <laughs> that was like the first thing he said to me. <laughs> so. Now I see why Cardone does some outlandish stuff every once I'm in a while, you know? Well, if you guys aren't doing video, get your butts in your front of your phone or a camera or something and start doing some video. Just shoot some landing page videos, shoot yeah. some videos, just get moving. All right. If anything, 
just tell your story to get started in That's practice. It. That's you know? it. And also, too, by the way, just as another side note, you can shoot a video and then put it on Facebook. And if you have a decent amount of friends, you'll get four or 500 views. Yes. Which is kind of crazy to think because, like, we struggle to get 500 views on YouTube videos with new Sam channel yeah. stuff. But, like, I'll get 500 views oh, immediately on Facebook yeah, if I yeah. shoot a video that way. Well, and uh, watch your own video. Like, athletes watch, you know, recordings of the game, footage. You go back and watch your video and you will pin, you will notice some stuff that you can improve at and you'll get better. I agree. All right. Well, go get your butt in the studio and do a video. Hey, if you love this and you're like, man, I want to get started with video, but you're also thinking, what are some other trends that are really picking up in the industry? All right. There's a video on it. We've already created it. It's right there. I hope you watch it. When we look at secure agent leads and how you did secure agent yeah. leads 12 months ago, we don't even do it anymore like that at all. No, no. We're talking about completely revolutionizing the actual digital 